Tonight, we're at the home of the Devils, Continental Airlines Arena, for the 2K Sports Network and the National Hockey League. The 2K Sports Network is proud to bring you the NHL here tonight. Bob Cole, along with Harry Neal, will be calling all of tonight's exciting NHL action. The Devils have won three Stanley Cups, and it seems to me every year they're challenging to win that fourth. The Devils excel at the offensive game. You watch these guys play, and you can see they have a very able and potent front line. Holy, how do they get it done? This team is a good offensive squad, and they are just a bunch of young guns. Good youth. They can out-hustle the opposition and last longer in games that drag into the third period or the overtime as well. It's time to start this game. Center ice for the opening faceoff. The Canadians get the opening faceoff. Taken into the zone by Montreal. In down low, Matt Pachuk holds it along the boards. Montreal picks it up. Boivu out in front. And the Devils regain possession. He brings it up. It's passed to the point. Zednik passes it. Up the center. Oh, and there they go, the Canadians on the attack. Rafalski controlling it at center ice. And here they come, trying to get something going. Rive had to kneel down to the ice to stop that shot. Huge block from Kovalev to Zednik. He carries it over the blue line. He passes it up the right side. Koivu with the puck in the corner. And he stops it with the right pad. Over to Gomez. Center ice. Eliash from Gomez. There it is, New Jersey on the rush. Theodore makes a nice pad save to Kovalev from Markov. Smooth stick handling there. Zednik, he scores! And with that, they jump out ahead of the road, showing that they really mean business tonight. He got up real close and let a wicked backhander go for the goal. He really took advantage of his position and a well-aimed shot. All goalies will tell you, backhanders are hard to handle. for the faceoff. The Canadians have the one goal lead now. First period of hockey, lots of time to decide this one. Madden holding the puck in the neutral zone. And Montreal gets it back in their own zone. The puck is hit up the right side. Taken into the zone by Montreal. Puck back to the point. It's shot. If the goalie doesn't make this save, you're down by two here in the first period. And you are behind the eight ball, to say the least. Breland puts the puck out center. Kozlov over to Madden. Shoots. Theodore makes the save. He sure doesn't want to give up this one goal lead to Ribeiro. He passes it up the right side. Along the corner boards. He passes it to the right wing. Rivero has it in the corner. Kozlov sends the puck up center ice. He brings the puck past the blue line. Along the boards with the puck. He rips it, and the top left corner was taken away by Theodore. He feeds it up the left side. Oh, and a chance for Montreal now. Oh, and Brodeur makes the save. His team down a goal right now. They can't give up another one. Rivera will be back in the game. They wanted to change up their attacking lines, and they get it. From Bouillon over to Rivero in the neutral zone. Ripped. Oh, and Brodeur with a terrific glove save. Passes it to the right wing. McGillney controlling it, and here they come. Three on two to the middle. And here's a three on two opportunity. He passes it to the left wing. From McGillney, Gomez through the zone. Over to McGillney. Shot, 
This is a stick save and a pretty good one off that wrist shot, Bob. We know it's tough to pick it up when it comes off the stick. You don't telegraph it at all on most wrist shots. He sends it up the center. Taken into the zone by New Jersey. It's shot. That was a great deflection by the goaltender. No rebound, no goal. Carried into the corner. The puck is centered. It's blocked. And they've got a three-on-two chance here. He scores! It's a tie game now here in the first period. He just tried to rip it and grip it, and he hit Pater. That was a nice slap shot for a goal. Harry, that left corner is suspect right now for this goaltender. That one whizzed by, and it looked like he might have had a chance to get it. Maybe. But you know one thing, they're going to keep shooting in that same location if they get a chance. in his own zone. Pandolfo takes it up through the zone. Less than two minutes left in the period. Langenbrunner carries the puck into the corner. Passes over to the left wing. And the Devils across the line again. Sends it to the defenseman. White gets that puck out, but not a good pass. To the right wing. Zednik has the puck at center ice. Oh, and they move it out quickly. Here we go. The buzzer signals the end of play here in the first period, and we've got an even score, one to one. The Devils were down early in this game, Harry, and then were able to tie it up again. It's hard sometimes to correct the deficit, but they have done a remarkable job here so far doing just that. What's been the main factor, do you think, in getting back into this game? It's taken some serious work for them out there in defense to keep this game tied. Showing a refusal to let up defensively has given them a great opportunity to grab this game before it's all over. The Devils know they have to continue to get scoring chances, especially here in the second period. They know they can score. They also know the opposition can score. We'll see how the second period gets going. Should be interesting. to drop the puck as we start the second period. The Devils win a key face-off with the game tied here on home ice. It's shot. He scores! Second period goal. That one will put him in the lead. He gets the rebound, Bob. Quick reaction, and he turned it into a goal. He just jumps on the puck and fires back at the goalie. It happened so quick, there was not a lot he could do. Passes the puck to the center. And now Montreal with it across the blue line. And he shoots. Brodeur makes a beautiful save to preserve this one goal lead. He feeds the puck to the left wing. Now at center ice. 
to McGilney from Elias. And he fires it. And Theodore makes the stop, keeping the deficit at just one. And now New Jersey in her own zone. The puck is hit up the left side. Eliash with the puck in the neutral zone. He shoots. Theodore with a pad save. Rive over to Kovalev. Koivu over the blue line. Shooting! Koivu unable to get his shot on goal. He's controlling the puck at center ice. He shoots. The shot is gloved down. He feeds it up the right side. Kovalev has control. Here's the odd man. Three on two. Coley, he had this one labeled. It looked to me like it was on the left post down low. He just got robbed on that shot. Here's an opportunity. And he shoots it. And it was stopped off that left pad. Bouillon plays it up to the center. Down in the corner. The puck now to the right wing. McGillis passes back to the defenseman. Through the zone with that puck. It's fed back to the point. It's a goal it's in the net. Well, here's a beautiful saucer pass to set this goal up. It could not have happened without that assist. Gorgeous play. Sometimes plays like that go unnoticed. But I'll tell you what, his coach noticed it. Superb job. Another face-off about to commence here shortly. The Devils are now up by two goals. While it's not an insurmountable cushion, it sure is one cushion they'd like to take to the third period. Lime sends the puck up center ice. And now Montreal with it across the blue line. And he shoots. Roder, great save. If he lets that one go by, this game is a one-goal game. He doesn't want that to happen. From Kozlov over to Madden. The Devils have just been on fire since the first intermission. And now they have a nice lead, Harry. They've made some adjustments, I know, here in the second period, and it's working for them. What's their new approach, do you think? They've had the perfect defensive mindset out there tonight, Bob. Whether it's been banging on defense with their big men, shutting down scoring opportunities, or fighting tooth and nail for every loose puck. They've earned that two-goal lead. Great chant here by the hometown crowd. They don't want this two-goal lead to operate. They know Harry can. Roberto has the puck through the zone. And he shoots. Roder with a great stop. The shot headed bottom right. Madden has it at center ice. It's shot. A goalie saying, I want my body in front of this shot. And he got it right where he wanted it. In the body, off the wrist. To the right wing, over the blue line. Ryder is against the board. And he scores! Now they are within one goal. Second period hockey. They want to get this one tied. Nice goal from the slot. I'd like to have a look at that one again. Yeah, it was a great setup too, Harry. He established position in front of the net, got the feed on a quick pass, and boom. Great pass and a great goal. That's hockey 101 right there, folks. And we're ready for the faceoff. The Canadians are now within one goal. That's a big goal, second period. They've been down two goals. Now they've got a chance here in the second to get this thing tied. And Montreal brings it back in from Sundstrom. Brodeur stops it. He blocked out the left side there. Rafalski passes it up the center. It's shot. He scores. And they now have the two-goal lead. Well, that goal here in the second period. Well, it took a little bit of positioning, a lot of luck, and a lot of skill to pick up the rebound like that and bang in off the crossbar for a goal. That was a sensational play. He was so aware to get on the puck and then to fling up a shot like that. He just made a ding off the crossbar, and the goalie knew he was beaten when he heard that awful sound. Terrific rebound goal, Harry. It really was. We'll get back to the action now as the official gets set to drop the puck. The Devils go ahead two goals now with that last conversion. Two-goal lead, second period. 
No. And he scores with the wraparound. That was nice. He really cut the goaltender out of position on this wraparound, Bob. Yeah, just a little too much room on that left side. He really stung him with that quality poke. Off coming up. The Habs have really accomplished a big goal with that last goal. They're now within one of tying this game in the second period. Let's see if they can take advantage of the momentum now. The puck gets set up the right side. Taken across the blue line by the Habs. Roder disrupts the offense. Beautiful poke check. And New Jersey has the puck. Defensive zone. Holy, this is just a huge save. You do not want to give up that lead going into the third period. And they still have a one-goal edge. Oh, a chance for New Jersey now. Langenbrunner has it in the corner. And Theodore with a terrific save. His team looking to get this one tied. Here come the Canadians with a chance. And now New Jersey's got it. Parise at center ice. Shot. That shot off the left pad. Well, the effort by the guys on the ice has resulted in a one-goal lead here tonight. The effort by the fans hoping it will be up to two. Yeah, and the fans don't want to let themselves start tasting this win yet. They're chanting for another goal. And that's the end of the second period. We've got a score of four to three. The Canadians continue to trail in this game here, Harry, and they're behind a goal to start the third period. Harry, why do you think they're playing catch-up right now? Being down by one, the first reason that comes to mind is that they have not been physical enough out there, Bob. They need to be more aggressive in front of the net if they want to stay in this game. The Devils skating now back out for this third period. Just about getting underway now. The coach likes their position right now, I'm sure. A one-goal lead is not something that you can be very complacent with. And it's period three. Players looking ready to go now. The face-off won by the Devils. Taken across the blue line by the Devils. Here he comes. He's got a chance. Yes, they're walking. They're taking the roof off, having a great time. That's what this crowd is doing right now. Yeah, you talk about momentum. This is sometimes how it starts. And he brings it past the blue line. Oh, a chance for New Jersey now. Back to the point. In the corner. Up the left side. Eliash carries the puck into the corner. Over to Zednik with the puck at center ice. The centering pass is made. Here come the Devils. Gomez holding the puck in the neutral zone. McGillney has control. Here's a two on two. Gomez behind the net with the puck. Gomez shoots wide on that one. Has it in the slot. The wraparound shot. He scores, and it's the second of the night. And he may not be done just yet. What a goal that was. Here he swings around and pokes it in on the right side. Just a beautiful wraparound shot, Harry. Yes, sir, Bob. The goalie was just a little too far from the post on that one. Officials got the puck in hand, and he's ready to start things up again. The Devils extended their lead to two goals with that last score, and it's third period hockey. You never like to be playing catch-up, and especially when you're in the third period. We're going to have to see a big turnaround in these two teams' game if the lead is going to change before regulation's over. Sore with the pass up the center, the neutral zone. Sent back to the point. He's... Roder stops it. He's keeping that two-goal lead alive. Through the zone. Over to the right wing. And along the boards with... And Theodore able to kick the puck. Dejeuner brings the puck up. 
Madden has possession along the boards. The puck deflected high and bounced off the glass. Taken across the blue line by the hands. Shot. Using the lumber on this play, he got all of that slap shot. It was a good stick save by the goaltender. There it is, New Jersey on the rush. Great speed and use of the stick. They thought they had a goal on that play. Now the puck up center ice. He passes to the defenseman. Malahov coming in off the bench. They give their forwards a rest with a shift change. He controls the puck along the boards. Matt Kachuk from Kozlov. Puck over to the right wing. Odd man rush, three on two now. The puck is in the far corner. A pad save on a point blank shot. It was a thing of beauty. Rafalski controlling the puck at center ice. It's passed to the point. Madden has the puck in the corner. To Rafalski from Madden. They block the shot. Good defense behind the goalie. It's deflected off the post. Theodore makes the pass to the defenseman. Kovalev skating. They've got a three on two chance here to the middle. And it's handled by Zudnik. Breland hits the puck out center. Past the blue line. It's shot. You have to have quick pads to play in the National Hockey League. And off that wrist shot, it was a pretty good left pad save. Goal! And with that, they've got themselves in a three-goal advantage in the inside track and winning this hockey game. Check out the wraparound shot on this replay, Bob. It looks like the goalie couldn't quite cover the right side in time. Yes, sir. One good poke puts another crooked number on the scoreboard. Skaters ready now for the official to drop the puck. The Devils have really given themselves a great position here in the third period. That puts them up by three. Now, all they have to do is play a little defensive hockey and put a W up on the board. He passes it to the left wing. Carried into the corner. Eliash. Theodore. It's sent up the left side. Oh, and there they go, the Canadians on the attack. He centers it. And now the Devils with it in their own zone. Puck over to the right wing. The Canadians get the loose puck. They're in the defensive zone. Taken into the zone by Montreal. To the point. It's shot, and it was stopped by that right pad. Mogilny sends it up to the center. Two on two. Here we go. And, he and Theodore with a save made with the blocker. And he was ready with a shaft down if it came in low. The puck to the left wing. Eulis brings it over the blue line with just under two minutes to go. A minute 48 on the clock. The puck is hit up the right side. Gomez skating with it at center. It's shot. Bob, he just got robbed gunning for his hat trick goal here in front of his hometown crowd. He wants to see those hats rain down on him. Past the blue line. Bulis with the puck. Glove save. Great play to commit on the shooter and then stop it. And this game is over with a final score, 6-3. to three.
That's going to do it. NHL action on the 2K Sports Network. For Harry Neal, I'm Bob Cole. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you'll catch us next time around on the NHL.